Hey my glam girls, welcome back to my channel. It's Chelsea where we talk about all things glam and all things girly. I'm a beauty consultant who loves to talk about everything dealing with beauty and makeup and today I am sharing with you my wish list for the Sephora holiday savings event. So I got some things I have my eye on, so I wanna share that with you guys. So stay tuned for all of that. Thank you so much for spending some time with me today. I truly do appreciate it. And let's get right into this video. Okay, here we go. So I feel like I don't have a lot of things on my list, but I'm sure if I added all of these to cart, it would be a lot. But getting started, we're just going to start from the top, work our way down. So I have the Makeup Forever Supreme Nudes Lip Rouge Artist Lipstick Duo set. So Gabe Loves Makeup said that these are really beautiful. The formula is great. I do like their new packaging and I've never tried these lipsticks. So I think for this set, I want to say that we get full size two full size one for $29. So I do wanna take a look at that. I think this set is actually in store, so I do wanna take a look at it, you know, swatch the shades, but I'm interested in that. I'm also interested in the Makeup Forever Rouge Artist Forever Matte 24 Hour Long Wear Liquid Lipsticks. These look beautiful and I've seen people wear these and I'm like pigmentation and opacity. So I definitely wanna get at least one of these maybe two because there's a lot of beautiful shades um this crimson red shade give it to me okay okay sephora collection i've got a couple of their brushes on my wish list so the first one that i have is a sephora collection pro powder brush number 50 and the 50.5 um it's a brush duo set so you basically get the full size one and a mini size one and I don't think I own not one Sephora collection brush. And I'm definitely like, where have I been sleeping at? Because I've heard nothing but amazing things about them. And they'll be 30% off. So remember, all of the Sephora collection products will be 30% off to everyone, no matter what tier you are. So I definitely want to pick up a few, but that is definitely one set that I want to get. Then I have my eye on the Dior. Then I have my eye on the Dior Mini Rouge Dior lipstick set. So I, Dior Lipsticks, Gabe Loves Makeup said this, and I was like, well, I've never not liked a recommendation for him. He was like, everything Dior Lips is a go. So when I saw this set, I was like, this actually looks like it might be a really good way for me to try like different formulas from the brand. I do like the shade so far in terms of what they look like on the models. So I'm interested in picking these up. I know that they're going to be small, but if they're not too small, then I think it'll be worth the value and being able to try different formulas and different shades. Now this next one, I'm like, Chelsea, why? Okay. Guerlain's Terracotta Sunkissed Natural Bronzer in the shade 03 starlight this is a new shade i already have three guerlain bronzers i'm obsessed with them <laughs> and i love like their holiday ones and i want to say that i have one that's probably the same shade but i feel like i need it so i might pick this one up i was looking for it i don't have it sitting here but it's over there but i don't i just love it and i just feel like I need it so it's on here I'm gonna go check my other shade that I have and if I have shade 03 I promise you I'll probably will get it I probably will get it <laughs> another product from Guerlain is their eyeshadow palette so I want to pick up one of the ombre G squad eyeshadow palettes they have a new shade I've heard really good things about their eyeshadow formula um, and I, I I don't know I just feel like this is gonna be a good formula it's definitely on par with Tom Ford's eyeshadow quad price. And um, I honestly am in my mind comparing it to the Tom Ford wet dry formula, which I absolutely love. So that's what I see when I look at these quads and that's why I'm interested in it. Like just to see is it as good. Then I have the Makeup Forever Artist Color Pencil that you can use for your eyes, your lips, or your brows. So I have the shade Limitless Brown, but I've heard nothing but amazing things about these eye, lip, and brow pencils. So I really wanna try them. Another brush that I have is by Sephora Collection, and it's the Pro Foundation Brush, the number 70 brush. This one looks beautiful. It looks like brushes that I like, nice and dense. 
um, that can, you know, put the product on quite quickly, but also very smoothly. So definitely picking that one up. And then the Givenchy Prisme Libre Loose Setting and Finishing Powder, the limited edition one. So I saw um, someone use this powder, someone that I know, and I asked them, I said, do you think this would show up against my complexion? Because it looks light, but I really want to find a shade that works for me because I love this powder. I have bought this powder in about two other shades and it looks beautiful on the skin, but one shade I felt was too light and one shade I felt was too deep. So I'm trying to find one that will work because I loved the way it made my skin look. It looked so poreless and perfected. So I'm really hoping this one will work. Um, so I'm definitely getting this one. It's, it's like one of the first things that I'm gonna add to cart to when I can. Then I have the Danessa Myricks Evolution Powder in shade 101. So I have shade 02. And when I say I am obsessed with this powder, oh, obsessed. This is a light as air, like light as air. I'm wearing it on my face today. It makes my skin look so perfected. And it's a really great powder if you want to do like a plethora of things like if you literally just want to dust like the lightest layer of powder on your face this powder works great for that because it is so light as air but if you do want to use it to really you know like really fill in the pores and make the skin look nice and matte and flawless but not matte and dry this powder works really well for that you can use it with a brush i like taking a sponge and kind of pressing it into the skin when i really want to look perfected love this this shade zero two works great for my face but it's it basically like almost matches my skin tone so i want to get shade zero one so i can use it for the under eye area and you know keep that area a little more bright compared to the rest of my face fenty beauty's gloss bombs or glosses i should say so i was watching tiktok and the shade hot chocolate has gone viral on tiktok and i was like why have i not bought that one yet because i love the gloss balm formula it's still one of my favorite formulas of lip glosses there is and i don't know why i didn't get it so want to get this one i also want to get the shade glass slipper and maybe fussy but definitely hot chocolate and glass slipper i have a couple of products from fenty skin so i have the Buff Rider Exfoliating Body Scrub with Super Fine Sand Plus Fruit Enzymes. Um, I was watching Rihanna do a little get ready with me and she was using this. And I feel like Rihanna can make any product look like, oh, I need that. So <laughs> I'm gonna try this one in store, see how I like the texture of the exfoliating beads in it. Then I have the Fenty Skin Cherry Treat Conditioning and Strengthening Lip Oil. So I'm kind of on the fence about this one. like. Not totally convinced I want to get it, but if you have tried it and you're like, Chels, get it, then I'm gonna get it. Leave that down below. And then also by Fenty Skin, I have the Butter Drop Whipped Oil Body Cream with Tropical Oils and Butters. Once again, uh, saw Rihanna using the body scrub and then using the body butter, and of course, it just looked so luscious on her skin. So I was like, maybe I need it? I think so. So I do want to try this one. I think the butter drop is in my local sephora so i will definitely feel it see if i think that's something i want to bring home with me and then i saw jackie Ina. so if you don't follow jackie Ina's ig page called lavishly jackie that page is a literally the life i want to live okay and i'm not ashamed to admit it i like every post that she puts up i'm like yep if I could afford it, that's what I would be doing. <laughs> so I saw her doing a get ready with me and she used the K-Skin Deep Water Hydrating and Soothing Body Cream with sea moss and Niacinamide. And her skin looked like it was glistening from this moisturizer. So I, I want that and I'm probably gonna get that because it just looked very hydrating and her skin looked so supple after using it. I have the Olaplex Hair Repair Treatment Set numbers three, zero, four, and five. I have all of these already. I love every last one of them. And I'm actually running low on the number four and five, the shampoo and conditioner. So for this value, I think this is great. Like really great. And especially if you wanna try Olaplex, you've never tried them before and you really wanna get a good 
handle on why people love the products and you also want to you know use the product in a system this set is a go to because one of these little bottles is like 26 dollars i want to say i think it's 26 23 um so getting all of these together in a set i think is a really great value definitely want to get this one i want to try the Dior Rouge Dior Forever Transfer Proof Lipstick in this shade called Forever Night. This is described as a deep berry black shade. Does it not look amazing? Does it not? I was like, I need that on my lips. Um, and I also want to try this formula too. It looks really beautiful and um, flawless on the lips. Like it looks like it would almost like smooth out any wrinkles that you might have. I don't know, but that's what it looks like it would do. So I want to try that. I have up here the Guerlain Rouge G Refillable Lipsticks. And I feel like I was watching someone's review like a while ago and they were talking about how they enjoyed this formulation. So this one is definitely a like, if I don't, you know, if I get everything that I want and I think I might want to make another purchase, I might get this one. Like this is definitely not going to be on my first round of purchases because I already know it's going to be a couple of rounds of purchases. Um, but I might get this because I've never tried any of the lipsticks from this brand. And I really do, you know, it looks pretty. I feel like I could enjoy it. I've just never tried them. So once again, if you've tried anything that I've mentioned and you're like, Chelsea, you should try it, leave it down below. Okay, a couple more things. I want to get another of the Necessaire, the body lotion. So I love this lotion. I purchased the Necessaire like starter kit back in April when Sephora had their savings of it then. And I fell in love with it. So then I purchased like during that same savings event, I purchased a full size of it and um, I need to purchase it again. So it definitely didn't last me from like April to now, but I mean, I use tons of different types of body lotions and creams. So I'm just now running out of it from like, you know, using other ones. But I love this body lotion because it's really nice and thick and hydrating, but it doesn't leave your skin oily and greasy. So it's one of those that you can put on. And by the time you go to put your clothes on, like if you put your body moisturizer on and like do a couple of things, by the time you put your clothes on, like you're not gonna have residue from the body lotion on your clothes. It's not gonna look greasy or, you know, just kind of feel icky as you're putting your clothes on. And it also like keeps the ash away. Okay, because I feel like, especially on my legs, the skin there is dry as a Sahara. And so a lot of times when I have lotions that are like, oh, this is gonna get rid of your dry skin. I'm like, no, it ain't. Cause it doesn't do anything for my dry skin on my legs. But this actually does. I feel like it does help to hydrate my legs. And I just really love the formula. The formula of the lotion is almost whipped, but it still is hydrating. It's a beautiful one and it's non-scented so if scents do bother you or you just don't like scents in your lotions then this is a really great one to try so definitely want to get another one of that and then the what are they called the sephora collection weightless false lashes i love those i think if i can remember the names i think like full fluffy full and fluffy and flirty was one um, there was like a everyday one, an everyday flare one. I think those were like my two favorite too. I, I tried like four different types. So I definitely want to pick up a couple of more of those, especially since they're going to be 30% off. But that's about it. Those are things that I have my eyes on that I'm really interested in. If you have any other things that you feel like I should check out, or if there's products that you're like, hey, Chels, are you going to review these? Leave them down in the comment section below and tell me the top one or two items you're gonna pick up during the savings event because you know y'all might inspire me to pick up something that i may not have had my eye on but if enough of y'all keep saying the same thing then i'm gonna want to try it too so leave me all of that down below and if you made it to this point in the video and you have yet to subscribe to my channel i would love for you to consider subscribing and joining the glam girl squad and guys that is it thank you so much for watching and i really hope to see you in my very next video Bye, guys.